case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1938, the Supreme Court of the United States heard the case of Missouri ex relidal Gaines v. Canada, which centered around the principle that states cannot treat their citizens differently based on race and that everyone must be provided equal protection under the law. Lloyd Gaines, a black Missouri resident, was denied admission to the University of Missouri's law school due to his race, despite being sufficiently qualified for it. Gaines took the case to court, arguing that this decision violated the 14th Amendment of the federal constitution. The state of Missouri defended their decision by claiming they had a separate law school for black students at Lincoln University and that there were other legal education options available in neighboring states. The Supreme Court agreed to review the case after the circuit court denied Gaines's writ and the Supreme Court of Missouri affirmed their judgment. Upon review, the Supreme Court ultimately ruled that Missouri's denial of admission to Gaines based on his race was unconstitutional. The court noted that there were law schools in neighboring states that admitted non-resident black students, but this did not justify denying Gaines's admission. The court ordered the case to be remanded to the lower court for further proceedings. They stressed that the state had an obligation to provide equal protection under the law and to offer substantially equal legal education facilities for all, regardless of race. The state's argument that they had made provisions for legal education in recognized schools outside the state did not serve as a valid reason to deny Lloyd Gaines's admission to their law school. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.